Tina has started. Okay. Where is it? Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the arena. Welcome me back to the arena. It's been a while. We've been focusing so much on other stuff. Um, we were doing Star Wars. And then we've been trying to focus on the um, MTG books. It's a really long book. Um, uh, I haven't really gotten around to finishing it yet. But we're almost there. We're in part 3. We're almost done. Anyway, so we're playing Jun Sacrifice now. Jun Sacri. Uh... And, um, well, so far, Jun Sacrifice is probably one of the top, I'd say top three of the decks out there, the meta decks that uh, you could be working on, playing for, net decking on, if that's your whatever. Um, and so, yes, so I'd say, I'd definitely say Jun Sacrifice, um, Fires of Invention, and probably um, Simic Flash. No, not the Simic not the flash ramp version the the simic classic simic ramp uh simic flash um simic ramp is probably there to uh, top five um with the whole th um um finale of devastation going on there but that's uh, i mean um it's it still feels a little bit uh weak in comparison it, i'd say it's a 1.5 here uh while it's john sacrifices uh, Probably tier one. Um, so we've got Cauldron Familiar, which is Oven, Gilded Goose, the the usual stuff. You know, the the whole combo, uh, sacrifice, and um, deal damage, heal yourself, ping for one one, and then we've got Murderous Rider there just to you know destroy any major threats like Planeswalkers because we don't really have any um, Planeswalker destroy cards except for Casualties of War. We do have four of it. We also need a lot of um, not really a lot as opposed to the rest of the control decks, but we do sort of play a little bit controlish by putting in 25 land. Um, we've got Thrashing Brontodon if we ever go up against the Fires of Invention or a Mirror Match, Jun Sacrifice. Um, and, uh, you know, Thrashing Brontodon is just so flexible. Even if there aren't any artifacts or enchantments on the board um, to counter those adventure decks, you know, um, Abzan Adventure or whatever, um, Celestia Adventure, Golgari Adventure, um, it's still it's still a three, at the end of the day, it's still a three to cast, three, um, three, four creature that can do three damage and a sort of, a, it can destroy artifacts or enchantments as a you know side note so you definitely um want to consider um, planning uh, uh, including actually brought it out into your plans as you play along we got four mayhem devils um because of course we are sacrifice um you got corvold fake cursed king um not in real necess necessity but if you get to put it on on the board uh he, he does wonders you just be prepared to sacrifice either some of your extra land or um, some of your extra food or your cauldron because you know you can always put bring back your cauldron familiar we've got massacre girl for those um well i i wouldn't exactly say that massacre girl is great for um mono red if you ever find yourself going up against mono reds but probably against those token decks like celestia i have a lot of one ones or two ones you know small creatures uh, that are easily dealt with, and then this, the occasional big cards for ultimately just ramp up those um, those minus, minus one ones. Um, casualties of War, we've already mentioned that. Beanstalk Giant is there to help you but gain more, you know, just draw out, thin your deck, put down more lands, because uh, Joint Sacrifice does as much as every other deck does have that sort of mana draw problem sometimes you get stuck with three sometimes you get stuck with four and then you just can't really do much after that but um that's why being stock giants here we also have fabled passage um and uh, you know gun sacrifice is such a simple deck and there's so many play uh, ways you can play with it so uh, we also have sideboards here but we won't be using our sideboards here because we're going we're actually going into best of one being weird it's not exactly picking up the audios as exactly as i wanted that's uh not so good starting off with two land is probably a bad idea but sure we'll keep it 
we'll keep it going. If we put this down and put that down, we'll see how he reacts. He's gonna start planning to destroy that witch's oven. Pretty much a staple these days. Go on the road. Yeah, he's gonna activate the fabled passage. What a lazy, lazy uh, Christmas season. Oh, we got Simic Flash. Okay. That's always something. Simiku Flash. Hey, hey, goodie. What a lazy Sunday. It is Sunday, right? It's a Sunday. He's taking his time. All that, put it down. Yeah. The McFlash tends to think a lot. One of their problems. Yeah, he's just he's starting to think, how am I going to do this? Wait, how am I going to get through this? This is I impossible. For sorcery. He just, I have no, he's like, I have no idea how I'm going to do this. If he counterspells this, then sure, I mean... Not like I'm going to be able to cast it time soon. Oh, sure. Probably going to put something down. <clears throat> um, what's it called? The Brineborn Cutthroat. Two. He's thinking, should I put it down now? Either, either he's taking his time, he, he's uh, thinking so long, or because I am uploading a few things, either that. Black's not there yet. <clears throat> I don't know if he can... What is it? To, to cast them because it disappears I think he has the little elf creature I'm just I'm forgetting what they're called um it's been a while I think it's been a while since I played him <clears throat> at least for my stand of course we are going back I'm not comfortable putting down the mayhem devil just yet knowing that he could counter it with although wait give me a sec here what what could he have to counter yeah he's not gonna have sinister sabotage he probably is going to use the called well, the the other one the three to cast or, or one to cast if not a thing mm. good news is we're nearing the six the six mark and it looks like he's got all blues, uh, all greens. Somehow, oh, nope. Just start getting damage. Five damage is a lot. Can't use that yet. Stuck with two. Stuck with two mana. And he I don't think he's got any creature spell second counter. 
Oh, well, that's cute. Okay. Interesting. Sure. Okay. This does uh, give him advantage on mana stuff. It is probably a problem for us. So I don't really... Hey, give me a sec here. Should I casualties of war destroy the green? He'll be left with one. Can't put down that flying creature. Or should I put down the mayhem devil? You know what? Casualties of war is too powerful. I don't think I can even cast it. No, I can, but. And sure, we'll have to do this. Damage. Now that green card. Hack. I hope he blocks. But then there's the off chance that he won't. Yep. Okay. I don't think he's gonna attack. I think he's gonna use it to put down like Isa. There it is. Hooray for you. That also means he's already used up all of his um, mana. He revives. I don't know, man. I've got casualties of war. So he's gonna. He doesn't have a blue. He doesn't have blue mana, so. What is up with this Simic, this new Simic flash ramp or this uh, flash ramp deck? It's stupid. And he decides not to attack because he thinks, what? I'm just gonna go straight for face. I right. put this down. That that would have been two damage, but he. Uh, oh wait, yeah, we can we can destroy this. Forget. I forgot we can play that. And uh, do we want to do this now? Yeah, let's do it. Baneswalker, land, creature. Uh, This is creature, right? Land. Oh, you are fucked, man. <laughs> oh, you are fucked. Back to two. My god. Good game. More like it.
pretty sure I clicked that. Fuck's sake, game. Stop lagging. Land. Enchantment. Creature. Mayhem Devil. This should be interesting. Turn. And draw two. Okay. Give me three two points of his health. 3-2 damage. Probably looking for a white. So that then he can cast uh, Time Wipe. How many is that? Three? Okay. Twelve. Okay. Hmm. Or vault. Sure. Auto pay. Field of uh, Fabled Passage. Auto pay. Murderous Rider. Sure. What else do we want to do? If we eat this, it'll heal. Oh yeah, you know it. I'm gonna milk this mayhem devil. I'm gonna milk it so hard. Oh yeah, baby. You know I'm gonna milk it hard. So hard. I get to draw a card. I sacrifice this. Uh, what do I want? Land? Okay. Put this down too. <laughs> oh, mama. Decline. Fine. I think I might need it. And we have enough. Uh, 
Uh, that'll teach him to use Azorius. Alright, um... So, uh, pretty, it's a pretty bad start. Crashing Brontodon. Mayhem Devil, I think I want a Mulligan. This is better. We've got the Gilded Goose. We can probably take out these lands. Because if we, yeah, then turn by turn, th turn of three. So we're gonna. Oh, right. Dang. I have to put that down. That was, a, yeah, that was kind of a. Bad. So we'll pull out the uh, the red. I don't think we need the pack. Well, we probably do need the pack, but eventually. Put this gilded juice down. Looks like we're going up either Celestia or Bant. Uh, we'll put down the witch's oven. Get that sort of that go in there. We've got beanstalk giant. Draw into a crumb, crumbly mumb. Got one, yeah. Down the human heart's desire. Oh, okay. So this is. Oh. I feel like I want to put this down first. Um, do we bean sock giant or do we immediately put down the him devil? Uh, if we put it down or too early, that's the thing. Put it down too early, risk having it going in for it. Put down. Already have a green. Something black. Not exactly. We're we're sort of setting up. Setting up a lot. Uh, the thing is, the good thing is, we're running out of cards. Put that. Okay, that's not something I should be really afraid of. One mana, he doesn't have yet. Please attack with the Heart's Desire. <clears throat> sure, go ahead. Um, alright. Blood Crypt. So, we can put this down. Throw this out there. Uh, we can't exactly use this. And... Because that is three to cast, we don't have three. We do have one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, Othakaya. Okay. Well, let him choose. That, um, it's the only logical thing, because then he won't be able to heal. Then we can do one damage, take out one of his, uh, Little duds. Additionally, we can um, create, can either create. What is this? This is a uh, this is tap to uh, a block. I mean block. My turn. Create a food token. Ah, right in just in time, pal. Just in time. Just in time. Okay, so we can actually cast it. Okay, that's Mayhem Devil. That's not bad. Um, I like how Jund is kind of like... It's a little bit like blood magic. Where you're using your health. And then you're, you're sort of uh, healing yourself with these... Call them potions if you want. Right, okay, wilderness reclamation. Coming down. That's a scary thought. E okay. Pretty scary. What's he gonna do, pal? So he's got four more. He's ending his turn. Hey, hey, booty. He's gonna have to sack one of these. Solve A. Okay. 
Um, Massacre Girls, not bad, not bad. Put that down. Turn. Got Cauldron Familiar coming down on the board today. And then we have like these little creature duds that will heal us. Alright, alright. So we got Absan. Absan Wilderness Reclamation. Which should be interesting. He probably has like a whole bunch of... How many mana do we have? Yeah, so... He's going for Kai's Wrath. Okay. Um... Well... Alright, sure. Kai's Wrath. And I guess I do have to do this. Uh, I could it's gonna die anyway. You're gonna bring it back and then it's gonna die. Um alright. And then we can eat a, a foodie. Right, right, right. No, um hold on. Do we wanna create food or do we want to sacrifice the food? Draw a card. Uh Auto pay, sure. Uh, okay, that's still land. I'll take it. Let him, let him do his thing. Right, and then that down. Sacrifice this. Nice. Also, get to draw another one. Um, another land, sure, I'll take the overgrown room. At least, you know, that was, that's like, that's a few turns where I get to do that, so. Sure. We can put down the Beanstalk Giant, and then if we have to, we can Witch's Oven, that, um, if he, you know, decides to blow it up. Another Kaya's Wrath. And then it'll give us two... One, two, we have the four, five, yeah, so I figured he's going to Kai's Wrath again, right? No, not a problem. We'll, we'll feed it. It'll get, give us two. That's cool. That's fine. Fine with it. We, uh, I guess we have to pass a turn because uh, it would be kind of a waste not to make use of, you know, not having the mana to. This down. It, okay. I just hope that, because at this point I don't really know. But yeah, probably the red. Red is probably okay. Um, and yeah, we'll pay for. We'll pay for. Yeah, we we pay for it. Put it down. This is black. Okay. Alternatively, we can also heal. Oh, going to destroy the witch's oven. Ah, okay. Well, I guess that's not really much of a problem for me, but you have to use it now. Otherwise, um, we're, we're losing our ability to draw stuff. Gonna have to consume... Oh, Corvold. Yes, baby. Mama Mia. Look at that Corvold. And, um... What else can we do? I, we just have to sacrifice. Sack it. Yeah, sure, sack it. Heal for once so that we can get the most. We can make the most out of this uh, trail of crumbs. We got another Witch's Oven. I think Mayhem Devil will be a better option here. Since he didn't destroy my Witch's Oven, so that's fine. Put that down. I have like. Uh, what was that? Two, three? And then four? 
I'm a little bit hesitant to put down Mayhem Devil, but I will. Uh, well, the combo is uh, the combo is actually Mayhem Devil and Torvald a uh, fast option. Oh boy. Well, we can put uh, Mayhem Devil in. Do we have one, two, three, four, five? We have enough for Corvold after we put it down. Then we can probably, yeah, we have to sacrifice something anyways. Probably gonna be the Cauldron Familiar. Goodbye, Cauldron Familiar. Do that. Um, actually, no, because we have Massacre Girl, so if we have to. Super, super bolt, whatever you call it, it's gonna allow us to draw. Orville is doing wonders just because of that ability to draw, and that's, in my opinion, that's just that alone. Being able to draw with Corval on the board, and being able to deal damage with Mayhem Devil. That alone is a winner. That is a, a winner combo. He, uh, I feel like if if he uses another board wipe, like maybe, um, yeah, Kaya's oath, uh, Kaya's yeah. I feel like that is already good. I, I've I've won the game that way. I feel like yeah. So see, and then it sacrifices. Um, his love struck beast is going to be saved. He's gonna send it back. But for me. I feel like I've already won the game. Uh, I've, I've gained that advantage just because of that. Okay, so let's see. We can put down the Cauldron Familiar. Or we're, we're kind of big on HP right now, so not really a problem for me. Uh, he doesn't have counters. I am confident that it. Do this. Uh, probably we need more of the black cards. We can pay for that. I think I do want to put down Thrashing Brontodon. Tap it immediately. Destroy that Wilderness Reclamation. That is doing wonders for him. This is an enchant. Although I could have like, so what I did there was try to bait out. So he's already used three Kaya's Wraths. So what I did there was I was trying to bait out another reason for him to put down Wilderness Reclamation. That then I can Casualties of War, uh, destroy the one, two. Then if he has four in there, he probably has two more two more Wilderness Reclamations in, uh, in, his, in his deck somewhere there. And we can destroy the Chromatic Lantern, which he probably only has two of. I don't think he would... Okay, Obstruct Beast has come down. And oh boy, we got a Johnny. Uh, gonna heal. Oh wow. Oh okay. Well, this just makes my uh, casualties of war even more satisfying because now he's. So that's kind of what we wanted. We were trying to force out. That's what you you kind of want to do. You play it a little bit slowly, then you kind of just want to force him out to do some drastic last ditch effort thing, and then that's when you really really just destroy him with this casualty this is gonna be so devastating you know the playing uh, this as it is uh, you want to draw so we'll draw and sure five damage we've got 26 hp all right that's gilded goose fine with me so we'll put down the the uh, let's do this first planeswalker land enchantment Artifact and creature. One, two. He only has one planeswalker. Um, we're gonna whatever destroy that. At this point, if he doesn't concede, I have no idea what he's doing. Then pay for that. Yep. He concede. Fifth. Fifth. 